What is going on? What the hell was that? All right, Blaze, have a good time in the movies, man. What the fuck was I flying like that for? What is happening? Combat veteran Mads Mikkelsen. Whoa, episode four. Okay. Uh, all right. Roxas? What is happening? I haven't played this game in how long and I come back into this craziness? what they're firing at man I gotta go
the hell? dude What is this? Holy shit. Merry Christmas, Foxes. Also, what is this? This game is how I'm gonna learn how to be a dad. Who is that asshole anyway? Yeah, doing a little bit of Death Stranding, and I just got into some crazy nonsense. Well, this game had no combat at all, and now all of a sudden I have a gun, and I can, like, shoot it at stuff. What am I fighting, dude? Of him. Why am I fighting him? I said I had a grenade, right? All oh, right here. in the face oh shit oh shit nope 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 can't fight him can't fight him he dick did he punch you sorry okay seven is all right Oh. 
What is going on? We need reinforcements. Bad. I got have a shotgun. Use blood bag. Oh, I don't have anything. I can drop it. Okay. I gotta say, for a game that doesn't have any combat in it, it feels pretty good to shoot in this game. Yo, he has no head. You were Roxas the God. Now you're Roxas the mod. All right, let me toss that blood bag. I'm still not even sure what I'm trying to do here, honest to God. I don't know if I'm trying to just escape or... Am I trying to find him or run away from him? Let's run. Since he's over here. Baby. Baby. Yep, these are his tracks. I'll definitely heading in his direction.
Enemy time. Okay, so I'm definitely hunting this guy. I'm hunting Mads Mikkelsen, one of my favorite actors. We need reinforcements. Guy right around here somewhere. You got the grenades all day, bitch. Call me the grenade thrower. Oh my god, I'm running out of bullets. Tell me I fight him, I might be screwed. Drink the gamer girl's bath. Oh, you're right. You're right, actually. Hold on. Where is that? At? I think it's over here. Good call, Roxas. The honest, honest to God, thank God you remembered about that because I didn't remember that. Whoa, Captain Azriel with the five months. I should probably like move the follow alerts so they're not like over my head. Thank you for that. Thank you for the five months with Twitch Prime. Thank you so much. Let's play that again now that you can actually see it. Uh, what should I wear? I, sh I should wear some gear. Get rid of my old assault rifle, right? Empty shotgun, yeah. Toss that. And pick up this new shotgun. Where am I? Over here. Let's 
like dead ahead of me. Oh, he's through here. Make that guy spawn off his body? What kind of crazy shit? I haven't played in like a month and this is what I come back to? This craziness? Trying to escape with the baby. Like, who is he though? Is he this baby's father? And that's the baby that I've been carrying around this whole time. On the A rating. Okay, I'll take it. Considering I didn't know what was going on. Merry Christmas to y'all. By the way, everyone, the uh, the camera is here, but uh, the ring light's kind of giving me a headache. So I'm just kind of turned it off. I don't want to have to like keep looking over there at the camera. Did no one else get sucked up in that tornado? Say again? What happened to me? The second you left the distribution center, the storm blinked out, just like that. Chiral density dropped almost as fast. I got caught in the storm and I was in a war zone. You've been daydreaming, Sam? Comms were only down for a second. No, it was much longer than that. There was this soldier. He tried taking my BB. If you say so. <laughs> the little one can vouch for me. 
Sam? It's been less than a minute since we last spoke. I can't be right. I was there for... for hours, it felt like. Maybe you should rest a bit. Never mind. Coming to you. It's a shame I can't meet you halfway. Yeah, I know. You kid, right? Be careful, Sam. Mm -hmm. I'm looking forward to seeing you. It's been a while since I've had company. Super weird. Oh, this is all my gear? Like, all my stuff got knocked off me? Sam, proceed to Mama's lab. Mama was part of the Cupid R&D team. However, from the start, she had concerns about its long-term viability. Help Cupid's had fundamental flaws, which might explain the strange phenomenon you experienced and the spike in chiral density. You should pay her a visit. See what she has to say. Well, she's pretty far away. I am 100% getting a motorcycle. I'm not about to run that distance. Decontaminating soon. All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Don't mind me. No. I go through, I should be able to get to our lab, right? Okay. Made it.
He doesn't bite. The fuck? I'm glad you made it. I did episode five was so fast. He's hungry. What the? What is going on? There, she's down. Even though she can't drink it, my body keeps making it. Going through the motions really helps with the soreness, though. What uh, is she? She's my daughter. And I'm her mama. It's okay. She's only connected to me. Not like the other BTs. You can see it, right? You're hooked up. Now you know why I can't leave. So about the supercell. Do you think the grown-ups could talk for a minute? Thank you. Look at this. This was the chiral density when the supercell appeared. But almost immediately after, it dropped to normal levels. In other words, the storm vanished in less than a second. That's impossible. Okay, let's pull the data from your cufflinks and take a look then. Well, that's all pretty crazy, but at least you're not. Timestamps in the logs support your story. Best guess I can muster is you were trapped between two different space times. Two different space times. HQ is doing a deeper analysis. All they've got to work with is the frequency spectrum. But with a little effort, they should be able to figure out where you were sent. Another Cairo spike. She's been crying more at night. Chiral density increases in regions connected to the chiral network, but the numbers are way, way higher than I projected. That's bad, right? Yeah. More connections means more chirelli. Early on, Bridges did acknowledge this as a potential problem, so I installed special limiters in the cupids to keep the chiral levels in check. Looks like the limiter on yours is faulty, though. The supercell and the temporal phenomenon that you experienced may be related to all this. Are you saying if I keep extending the network, we might be in for more temporal phenomena? Maybe. Or worse, they cause another death stranding. Oh, but you got a solution. Of course I've got a solution. Right over here, in fact. I have this robot called Metal Gear. Oh, a new one? We just need to integrate a limiter into this new cupid I threw together. Thought I'd make you one since you said you were coming. Great. Crisis averted. No, crisis not averted. We need to rewrite the software to work with the new hardware. Well, then get to it. Yeah, um, 
No can do. I designed the hardware, but the software was written by someone else. Well, where can we find them? Her. The name's Lochner. She was a member of Bridges One. You'll have to head to Mountain North City. All right. I gotta take a Cupid there anyway. Oh, good. That's great. Here we go again. I don't know what's gotten into her lately. She's so scared. Look at her. Maybe the other side wants her back. Maybe she wants to go back. We can't keep on like this. That much I know. You want to tell me what happened? She was due. I was in the hospital waiting for a C-section. Then the terrorists hit us. under the rubble. Nothing to do but wait. And wait. <laughs> Felt like forever. But no one came. They said air and water. Trapped her the whole time? And the cold set in. I gave birth there in the rubble. But instead of bringing life into the world, I brought death. ever since but she's a BT the ties that bind her to this place bind me too you could say I've never really been discharged and you're okay with that I mean you know she's gone you want to live your life in the shadow of the dead come on <laughs> you of all people you chose the dead over the living why else would you be here I just remembered. Dead men told me repatriates have special blood. Mind if I take a sample? Yeah, sure. Suck me dry. You already bleed me in my sleep. A bit cold, ain't you? Just a second. There. 
All done. I want to run a test. Mama, are you? I'm sorry, Sam. Would you mind leaving us alone for a while? Yeah. I gotta get to work. Weird. Sam? Hey, forget what I said about chiral spikes. Reconnecting the world comes first. Maybe we're making things worse. Maybe not. But it's the only plan we've got. Good luck, Sam. Sam, the delivery terminal outside still works. Go ahead and get it connected. I'll give you further instructions from there. Ah, that's why I couldn't use it earlier. Sam, your next objective is to bring Mountain Knot City into the network. Now, this route will take you to a way station and on to a distro center north of the city. From there, it gets tricky. You'll have to take a detour to get around the mountains. Still won't be using this Cupid on the way? Software's not been rewritten yet. It's fine. If you link up Mountain Knot City after your Cupid is fixed, the update should filter through the network, stabilizing the connection. It's just one more reason to get there ASAP. But for now, make do with the Cupid you've got. Uh -huh. Any word from Mama Lee? None. We'll just have to hope she's all right and keep going. It's what she would want. Oh, this controller's driving me crazy. Anyway, check in at Lake Knot City Southern Distro Center before you hit the road. And good luck out there. By the way, Sam, I've added a zipline schematic to your PCC. Figured it would come in handy. All you need to set one up is at least two anchors. Why bother carrying cargo across a river or up a steep hill when you can just send it through the air? Am I right? If you want a little hands-on experience, you can use the anchors outside my lab. Have yourself some fun. The good news is, Fragile's available and willing to lend you a hand. If you want Fragile to send you, you'll need to head to a private room. South Knot City looks closest from what I can see. It'll be a lot quicker than walking, that's for sure. But you can't take any cargo with you, so there's that. It's up to you. Just remember the options there if you need it. Okay.